Yes, season six, all coming down to this final matchup. North America versus Europe, defending world champions against a Cloud9 team that's eager to bring the title back to North America. Carpet, this is a storybook ending. There's really not much else to say that hasn't been said. Cloud9 in new territory, but a territory that we've expected them to be in for the past two seasons. There's somebody that was always projected to be here at the end with Dignitas, and now they have finally done it. Now they've made quite a terror in the lower bracket, one of the longest you have to make, pretty much, and they've taken down the best of the best. But now they're actually at the best. Dignitas, they are undefeated this season. Is this going to be the falter or will they stay strong? The perfect season for Dignitas on the line here. Cloud9 trying to make it happen. North America has not won a world championship since season one. And Dignitas looking to add a third title to their team's record. Here we go. Are you ready, Las Vegas? Game number one, the World Championship on the line. Tur Turbo now centering that ball out to the middle. Gimmick gets it to Torment. Violent Panda challenging. Gimmick low on boost. Just going to wait for it. Goes for the flick by one. Kadop has full boost. Can he make the play? On the wall, taking his time. Center ball. Turbo's there, but Torment got in the way. We talk about what a defender oh, he is. Oh, just wide torment. Almost capitalizing on that defensive mistake by Dignitas. Torment on the back wall, a demo by Squishy on KDOP. Panda with the challenge. Squishy on the wall, hits it down the sideline. KDOP is there, booming clear. Turbo's up, gets the touch. Gets the Going out down. to the middle, KDOP with the shot saved again by Torment. Now hit. Ball out for Squishy. Squishy down to Torment. Torment popping it up. And now follow up. Kadot with the block. Tur Torment dodging that bump. That was big. Now he's able to make that save. Shot coming in. Squishy hits it up to Gimmick. Gimmick into the middle. No one's there. Panda is able to hit it back. Torment with the response. Kadot up. It's going to leave it for Turbo. Turbo hitting it into the corner. Gets another pass. Kadot has to turn around. Torment hits it upfield. But now, Dignitas on the attack, Squishy on the back wall. Clear of his own, Turbo hits it back. KDOP, not the greatest touch, and the first goal of the grand final goes to Squishy in Cloud9. Trying to trap this ball on the ground, KDOP, he was faced the wrong direction, couldn't gain control of his car, which left Violent Panda in one of the worst spots, and Squishy there to take advantage. Cloud9 is not nervous. They're ready to take it to Dignitas. They do not care what their win streak is like. Turbo with the pass. Torment on the back wall. Gimmick, low boost in net. Squishy, not much, but he takes a shot. Turbo easily gets the save, hits it off to the side. Turbo with the hit upfield. Torment waiting. Pops it up for Gimmick. What can he do? Taps it off the backboard, but Turbo ends that play. Squishy, follow up shot, a bump from Gimmick, but he couldn't get out of the way of the shot. Now Torment. Goes for a shot himself. And a save there, a demo on Violent Panda. And Squishy with the demo, three on one. But Turbo with a key clear. Torment, taking his time, goes for the 50, but misses. Kadop will have possession in the Cloud9 corner. Gets it by one, Gimmick with the challenge. Does force it downfield, Squishy dodges the demo. But Turbo hits it off the side. Gimmick looking for a play, trying to get in the way. Does get. A demo there from Squishy onto Violent Panda. Cloud9, very physical. Not something we see out of them. Generally, we'll see it out of Dignitas sometimes early on. But Cloud9 right now trying to take them out before they gain control. But Kadop doesn't want to let it get in his half. He's trying to keep the challenging up. And a miss there from Torment. Turbo will take possession. Gimmick off the ceiling. Violent Panda with the shot. That one easily saved by Squishy. Dignitas still in this game. Two minutes left. Just one goal separating a hit there from Gimmick. That's going to put it off the backboard. Turbo was there, denied it. Now Panda off the side. Squishy getting in the way. Turbo gets it by. And oh my, almost sneaking through to the defense. Torment was able to make the save. Get up this the pass. Could be dangerous. A shot attempt missed by Kadop. Passing it off the backboard. Turbo there also off the backboard. Torment. Finally, relieving some pressure. 
Backflip there from KDOP. Squishy's gonna have some space. KDOP turning on it, pops it up for Turbo. Turbo back down to KDOP. KDOP gets that pinch wrapping around the wall. Panda trying to pass it to himself, but Squishy cuts it off. Torment getting the clear. Turbo. Dig Dig's backing off a little bit sooner than I'd expected, but maybe it's because the physical plays from Cloud9, plus we saw the defense they were able to bring out against Weedem girls. Oh, and the window almost opening there. KDOP saw it. Final minute in game one. Torment getting it up. KDOP drops it down. Gimmick doesn't let Panda take the shot. Torment, another clear. Turbo pops it back up. Squishy was waiting in the middle. Used up all his boost for that hit. Now KDOP taking possession. Violent Panda gets blocked by Torment. Ball up in the air. Panda, not much boost. They go for the pinch there. That's going to buy them some time. And KDOP does get full boost. Time running out for Dignitas in game number one. KDOP with control. Good first touch. The pass. He got the, it. Oh, the give and go. KDOP is able to pull it off. The give and go inside of Cloud9 half. KDOP to Panda right back to KDOP. Squishy left in one of the hardest positions as a defender. And they'll tie it up with only 22 seconds. And just like that, Dignitas close the gap. Kadop off the side. This could be another chance. Saves. Oh, he almost got the air dribble, but Squishy is able to make that save. Still not out of the danger yet. Cloud9, final 10 seconds. It's up. Torment. Good first touch from him. Going for the clear. Gets it by Panda. Squishy takes it over to Torment. Into the middle and giving off the backboard. Squishy couldn't get to it. Overtime in game one. Squishy with the challenge. Torment again. Gimmick with a shooting opportunity. Good first touch. That shot just high. Follow up from Squishy. And Cloud9 take game one. We talk about how threatening a kickoff plan can be, and you see it right here. Overtime in the first game of the Grand Finals. Seven seconds in, and taking a look just one more time. That is how you do it. Such a good play from Gimmick. He touched it up to himself. He could have gone for the pass right away, but that brilliant first touch, especially in that dominance, allowing him to get enough height to put that off the backboard. Squishy with the follow-up, a beautiful play. And this is the reaction to their overtime winning goal. Baiting out that defender, forcing neither the one that's closest to him or farther to him farther from him to be able to have any confident hit. I love him. I just love that was, him. I, I love I, him. If you're a Cloud9 there. fan, <laughs> you would certainly love Gimmick for that play. <laughs> Squishy finishing off that goal, but really that was all Gimmick in a position where he had options, made the decision that put Cloud9 in a spot to grab that first game. And it is going to be a long road for Cloud9. They need to not only win this best of seven, but another best of seven against a Dignitas who has won 17 series straight. As we watch this series unfold, going to be keeping an eye on what is making Dignitas play a little bit slower, a little bit more passive. Not as much midfield passing plays, not as much aggression coming into Cloud9's half. Is it because their defense? Is it maybe just because they're a little bit timid? They've been here twice before. I'd almost say there might be even more weight on the shoulders of Dignitas to keep this title because of how much we pumped them up because they are undefeated this season. We'll see if Cloud9 can keep it going or if Dignitas bounce back. Game number two. Squishy wins this up the side. Kanop downfield. Gimmick over the side. He'll follow this up, passing it. Long, trying to get it off the backboard. Panda doesn't let that happen, but Torment will have a play. It's off the corner of the ceiling, bouncing down, went across net very briefly, but KDOP had the play. Squishy with the demo, and the pass. Gimmicks waiting. Cloud9 strike first in game two. These physical plays, seeing them out of Cloud9, that may have been circumstantial, but immediately, the moment they heard that explosion, they all turned to get on offense. 23 seconds in. And they'll get the first goal. Dignitas on the back foot right now. Cloud9 has come out swinging. Torment isn't able to get a touch. Turbo with a Turbo. dunk there. That one almost finding the back of the net. And now Torment challenging Kadop. Squishy goes for the clear. 
Up to Gimmick. Gimmick, it was just out of his reach. Good pass to KDOP. That one's going to be wide, but it bounces far back. Gimmick with a touch beats out Turbo. Counterattack opportunity. But Turbo. Pando was able to send that back in. Now Squishy, upfield. That demo will relieve some pressure potentially. KDOP getting beat there by Gimmick. But now Turbo up into the middle for KDOP. KDOP's waiting, passes it down, but that was a slow follow from Turbo. Squishy up, he sees Torment. Torment up for the shot, and he was met to the ball by KDOP. A lot of times when I see a ball bouncing out to the midfield or a third touch on an attack Dignitas, I just don't see a player there when I'd usually expect it. I Ignite spoke about Cloud9 and that shot there, finding the back of the net. Torment coming up huge through two defenders. Violent Panda is the only one that had no boost, no one getting up to read that, and Torment from offense read it better than they did. That was such a good read from Torment. Gimmick air dribbled that ball out, it ended up getting pinched, and Torment was ready and waiting. Cloud Nine now two to nothing in game two. Okay, now going for the center, Squishy gets that touch. Torment will take over. Oh, and Mind Games, the first defender, Gimmick going for the bump. Does manage to make KDOP hesitate, but KDOP still able to make the play. Squishy, not much boost, gets the hit. KDOP, long clear downfield, Torment denies the clear. But KDOP with the follow-up, into the middle. Gimmick with one touch, Turbo with the challenge. No one there for Dignitas Toss again. They're just letting Cloud9 have this control. Cloud9 getting those composed counterattacks, Torment also, a clear here, KDOP looking for Panda in the middle, or Turbo, rather. Now Panda going up for this ball, and they just give up possession yet again. Shot from Gimmick, that's hard, almost finds it. KDOP with the save, center ball, and Turbo manages to get this clear. But a retreating demolition from Gimmick will relieve so much pressure. Violent Panda's not able to get across to take the position of Turbo. And Turbo dropping that shot on target, but Torment the brick wall. And, uh, Another save here from Gimmick. Cloud9. Holden Dignitas scoreless as we approach the two minute mark. Turbo's chasing it down. Another save there. And a demo from Squishy. Cloud9's demos and bumps have been relentless. Gimmick. Hits it off the ceiling. Panda. Misses his hit, Gimmick makes him pay! Three goals now for Cloud9! Somehow Cloud9 got more confident going from Weedem Girls to Dignitas. They're playing cleaner, they're playing faster, and Dignitas, they seem much more passive than I've seen from them in a long time. Starting to see cracks in the armor of Dignitas. They've seemed invulnerable, but Cloud9 is making it look like they're beatable. Squishy, the tap out. KDOP into the corner. It's gonna bounce out for Panda. Panda puts it off the wall, but no one to follow up. Good touch from Torment, but the shot coming in. Squishy, no boost, gets that save. Squishy, nothing in net, absolutely nothing. There it is, physical play from Dignitas, taking out the goalie. Gimme getting bumped on spawn as well. Gimmick with a touch there, not the greatest. KDOP was out of position, and Gimmick is able to get that clear. Tries the back pass, it does find Panda. And Panda with a big touch there, Gimmick last defender. Goes for the soft first touch and the challenge, and gets it by KDOP. Great play from Gimmick to relieve pressure. Hit up field. Panda waiting for it. And gets it by one, squishy in the back. Soft first touch. Doesn't flick it by KDOP. Turbo centers this ball out in the middle, but no one's there, and Squishy all the way in the back corner gets the demo on Panda. Great read from KDOP. Time running out, Dignitas on the cusp of being shut out, and a miss there, Gimmick is gonna clean that up. Cloud9 secure this game. What is going on with this Dignitas, James? Am I the only one that sees this? 
I don't know where this passiveness came from. So many times we see something that may have been an open shot or another potential hit off the backboard, and that third man's just not there. Nobody has done this to Dignitas. Right now, final 10 seconds. Paid up one last shot, but that's gonna be it. Cloud Nine take back to back games. Game number two. That's it, Cloud Nine. We did not see this coming, did we, Carpet? No, we did not, but I'm I'm honestly not only I am incredibly surprised that Cloud9 is playing this composed with this much weight, but I'm even more surprised that Dignitas is playing the way they are. I hope you're seeing the same thing I did, or I have been seeing, unless I'm actually insane. We'll take a look at the first goal scored there. You see that bump on gimmick, another demo, just so much physical play. Nice, let's go! Team that we talk about not having a lot of emotions. You can see it there, you can hear it there. It might not be a lot, but it's because they know they have a lot of Rocket League ahead of them. And that was Gimmick on camera reacting to his goal. Gimmick a hat trick in game two. And and Carpet, these demos, this, this play from Cloud9, we haven't really seen it that much of them yeah. to this degree. They, Squishy at one point, the ball was in their half and he demoed Violent Panda in the opposite half while they were on defense. I mean, he knows how strong their plays are. And at this point, you have to understand how Dignitas plays. One or two of them are gonna come beat most of your defense, and the third man is almost always the one to push that through. I'm with you there. Where is Shogun? <laughs> Wish he was here, but we'll have to make do with what we got. And what we have is a North America versus Europe grand final. Game number three, Cloud9 looking to take this first best of seven. Popping up for Torment. Violent Panda racing to it. Chance for Squishy. Squishy off the backboard. Leaves it for Gimmick. And Gimmick, seven seconds in, scores for Cloud9. Another kickoff goal. Is this their tactic? Is this what it takes to beat Dignitas? Is it just kickoff plans? Is that all it was this whole time? We saw a fake kickoff from Cloud9 earlier in the day. They are just feeling it, firing on all cylinders. Torment off the backboard. Gimmick with a touch. Squishy's up. He's gonna put this off the corner of the ceiling. Center ball. Kadop with the clear. Now Torment touches it down. He's not gonna be able to get that. Has no boost. Squishy comes in to help. Centers to Gimmick. Gimmick up. But Panda knocks it away. Torment with one win. Kadop coming in. Challenge from Squishy gets beat. Panda with an opportunity. Now Kadop sees Turbo in the middle, but oh, that looked like the net was open. Turbo was racing back. Touch there. Now Panda up to Turbo. Turbo across the field. That will be high and wide. Kadop with the follow-up. That shot high. Cloud9 completely shutting down this Dignitas offense. They're getting run dry, all under 40 boost. Turbo, center ball, Panda puts the shot off the crossbar, follow up from Kadop. It's not gonna happen in Cloud9. Get away without <laughs> yielding a goal. That certainly seemed like Panda was gonna put that away. I can't believe he didn't. And then the follow up from Kadop, even after demolition on a Cloud9 goalie, still wasn't on target, but it was an incredibly difficult angle. Cloud9 on the attack, squishy on the sidewall, off the ceiling. Gets the shot. Turbo with the save, but Gimmick still attacking. Challenge there, Panda. Precarious spot from him, the dunk from Torment. And Cloud9 extend the lead to two. They are tearing apart Dignitas, shot after shot. Just barreling through. And Cloud9 in game three continue to just slack. Dignitas off the kickoff, Squishy, whoa, he got the foot reset, the follow-up from Torment, Cloud9 making it happen. Where are the answers from Dignitas, Cloud9 with the plan from these kickoffs, Squishy baiting out the first defender, and Torment hot in pursuit, it's unbelievable. And Squishy got that foot reset, didn't even need to use it, 
left that for Torment. And the demo from Panda on Torment. We're starting to see Dignitas respond with some demos of their own. Gimmick, not letting that shot come on target. Hit back. Turbo into their own corner. Going for the challenge. Now, ball going out into the middle. This is still a dangerous gimmick. Cleans it up. Absolute crushing by Cloud9. Oh, my. Everything Cloud9 is doing right now is something you'd put in some sort of tutorial video. Every challenge they have, every pass they have, every time they're on attack or from kickoff, they have a plan. They're executing nearly perfectly. Who would ever think someone would put Dignitas down four goals after winning two back-to-back. -back. This is unbelievable. Cloud9 playing on a different level. Panda going for that shot. Gimmick with the save this time. As we just passed the halfway point in game number three. Torment on the wall. Gets it by Kadop. Good touch. Gimmick not able to get to the ball in time. Turbo. Over to Panda, but Panda's just not able to get there. Torment with the hit downfield. Almost gets a piece of it now on the attack. Torment, no boost to work with. Just 12 in the tank. Sends it back into the corner. Panda back downfield. Gives up possession. Gimmick getting challenged. Chance for Panda. Panda puts it wide. When we usually see such precision from Dignitas, they're just not delivering right now. We saw Panda put... Very good opportunity off the crossbar, and the save oh, from man. Torment! Dignitas must be thinking, what do we have to do for a goal? Now Turbo off the corner. Torment again denying, off the backboard, dangerous up. spot. Panda, that shot off the post! Now Gimmick with that 50-50, squishy up. Into the middle, a miss there. Double commit from Dignitas. Squishy full boost across the field to Torment. Torment, the shot on target. But Squishy trying to redirect that one. Kimmick. Going for the clear himself. Hits that out into the middle. Could have been bad, but they recover. Squishy, center ball. Torment's there, and then blocked by Torment. Gimmick, back out into the center. Double commit yet again. Panda was able to backflip to save his positioning somewhat. But Cloud9 on the attack. Under a minute left to go. Cloud9 up by four. And a miss from Panda. Kadop, last one back. Squishy gets that incredible touch to get it by one defender. Get, gimmick was there, didn't get much of a shot on it. Kadop missing, Turbo not there. What is happening? It seems like Dignitas they are not feeling it. Cloud9, on the other hand, Torment said they were. As the final seconds tick away, Cloud9 in game three. Get one more on the board. Torment with the flick and a five to nothing shutout in game three. Let me put this series into perspective, just so everyone can understand how ridiculous this is. Dignitas has scored one goal this series. The least amount of goals they've ever scored in a series is six. James, it's, I, I, I don't, I, my brain isn't working right help now, Carter. Me. This, my brain needs to work because I'm supposed to be the color. This, you need to help me. <laughs> this was supposed to be the perfect season for Dignitas. You, the, you heard the desk. Everyone thinking that Dignitas was unbeatable. 17 and 0. Cloud9 have to beat them twice. And now in this first series, Cloud9, they look like they're playing at a different level. If Cloud9 take this, they will ruin the perfect season for Dignitas and continue their shot at the title. You see the smile from Squishy. Cloud9 fighting for the dreams of North America. Turbo Pulsa and Dignitas, they have something else planned. And it's not over yet, Carpet. We've seen reverse sweeps in best of sevens. It's not impossible. And Dignitas, they're on a record-breaking season right now.
The Titans are shaking in their boots, James. I have never seen Dignitas play like this. And I've never seen a team stick it to him like this either. Cloud9 showing us something new today. We have what could be the final game in the first match of the grand final. Let's hear it. Cloud9, Dignitas, game number four. On kickoff, it's back to Gimmick. He's just gonna hurl it towards net. Torment trying to get the touch, but Kadoff cut it off. No boost for Squishy. Attacking opportunity, Turbo's up. That shot underneath the crossbar and in. Dignitas respond. The second goal this series. Can you believe that I'm saying that? That is only the second goal they've scored, but there it's, I guess, kickoff's the strategy at this high level. Just, just beat them on kickoff when they're not there in rotations. We've talked about how important it is to make sure that you are settled as quickly as possible from that kickoff. And Cloud9 has been striking first very quickly. Now Dignitas get a piece of the action. Turbo again, that shot towards net, blocked by Gimmick. Squishy with some time and space. Wave dash, gets another wave dash. But that was shut down by Kadop. Demo from Squishy on Turbo. He's got his sights set on that man. Panda with a big block. Gimmick going for the clear, but Kadop has something else planned. Kadop with the double tap. Dignitas ahead by two. This is what we love to see out of this team. Consistency and perfection. Kadop following that. He never misses those, man. You can't stop him. Dignitas starting to wake up. Cloud9 has been playing all day. Dignitas. They've just been waiting for a little practice, and now in game four, it appears that they are heating up. Turbo, flicks it by Torment Panda. He's got a wide open net, needs a boost to get there in time. Gets the dunk, but it goes wide. Center ball, Torment, hits it clear. Gimmick, into the corner. Panda now wrapping it around. Torment used up all his boost for that one. All because the pressure from Turbo to try and demolish him in net. It forced him to attack that from a weak angle. It's so quiet, you could hear a pin drop in this stadium right now. Everyone holding their breath, seeing if Cloud9 can pull this off. But Dignitas, they have brought it for game four. That shot oh, forces a double commit. And the demo from KDOP, numbers advantage. Gimmick. Able to buy some time, gets a flick, that's up. Panda, heading it back, Torment waiting for it, but P Turbo able to pass it over to Panda. Ball slowly bouncing towards net. Gimmick hits it off to the side, but Turbo doesn't let that clear happen. The follow-up, a miss. And now Squishy getting control, going for the flick, gets it by one. But Turbo now has his chance blocked by Gimmick, Kadop up. Panda. Leaves that, decides to get boost. Now long clear, Torment has to turn for this. Hits it into the corner, he'll follow it up. Gets one 50-50, but it's up to Turbo. Turbo with the pass, and Squishy heading it down the center. This is the speed from Digitas we've been waiting to see. They're positioning in midfield, just lingering around, getting off the shots. Oh, and Turbo went for the bump on Torment, but no one from Digitas had the follow-up shot. What a bridge, what a challenge. Another one. And that one almost bounces in. Torment gets the ball out of danger. Squishy now double tap chance, but he bails out. Saw Kadop had it. Panda, upfield. Torment heading it off to the side. Squishy has no boost. Torment flicks it chase. by one. Turbo with the follow up. Three to nothing. Dignitas answer. They have woken up this angle from Turbo. Kadop and Turbo always working together. They pull out Cloud9. They gave him the confidence and they're slowly taking it away. This is the Dignitas that we were expecting to see out of the gate. They waited till game four to show us. Is it too late for this series? Kanop misses his touch, but gets that another. pass in the middle. A team bump there. Almost spelled disaster for Cloud9. Turbo going for an air dribble, gets bumped. That one almost finds its mark. Gimmick off the side. Torment over to Squishy. Squishy the shot. Oh, that's just wide follow-up. That's also off the post and a block from Kadop. 
Dignitas get away with murder right there. Trying their best to keep it away from the defenders. But they forgot about the fourth one in the post. Now off the backboard, Panda doesn't let it happen. Kate up, center ball. Violent Panda leaves it for Turbo. Nobody home for Cloud9. And now four to nothing, Dignitas are just taking it to Cloud9. Has the switch been flipped? Cloud9 cannot muster up anything this game. Dignitas in full control, just when it looked like they'd fallen apart. Is the support from their org really helping? Turbo talked about how they helped him be able to keep a strong mentality. And even when losing three in a row, here they come out. And at this point, when everyone's so good, mentality is such a big factor in the game. That shot coming in. But there is nobody with a tougher mentality than Dignitas. They've been on these grand final stages so many times and come out on top. And a demo there, turbo on Squishy. Demo trade. Now Panda downfield, Squishy with a good first touch. Centers it, but Turbo gets in the way. Panda going for the pass. Turbo didn't get a shot. Final Notice 30 seconds. You just see the difference in this game. The moment Dignitas House starts to challenge at that midfield, the moment they cut off everything that Cloud9 has. Now Panda, perhaps they're waiting for that zero second fifth goal as Cloud9 did in game three. Turbo. Going for a shot, that one easily blocked by Gimmick. Squishy, down, hit by Kadop. And the final seconds tick away. Dignitas respond in game number four. Prevent the sweep and stay alive in this first match. Four to zero. 12 shots, three saves, three assists on the four goals. That is a Dignitas scoreboard. That right there is a Dignitas scoreboard, my friend. And we're gonna take another look at that KDOP double tap that really helped get Dignitas back in the right mindset. I'd like to think that they were just, they would wanna put on a show, you know? They're gonna wait until game four to wake up, apparently, and I really wanna know what it is that was plaguing them. They must, they cannot have felt great, but Cloud9 are living up with them. Let's go! Fucking nice show, let's go. You can hear them getting amped. Dignitas not ready to give up just yet. You know, there really is no downtime for them. They, they can score the greatest goal ever, and all they have enough time is for like one fist pound and a yeah. And then they have to keep playing. It's got to be pretty tough. You really don't have a lot of time to celebrate on your great moments. You just have to keep showing for the rest of that game. And five minutes in this game feels, feels like about 15 or 20. Yeah, and Turbo, though. Turbo had a hat trick there in that game. He, although Dignitas is back-to-back -back world champions, Turbo is the three-time looking to make it four. Here we are, game number five. Cloud9 still one game away from closing out this series. Dignitas, they want to come back and get that reverse sweep. Kate up, off to the corner. Squishy up the side. Panda getting dunked on there by Squishy. But he keeps his composure, pushes the ball downfield. Kadop trying to pass that off the backboard. Torment makes that save. Now Panda drives by, leaves it. And now Squishy, oh, he gets beat. Panda was hoping Torment would miss that in the center from Kadop, but no one from Dignitas there to really get a threatening shot. Another chase down demolition as well during that play, and it worked out just barely at the end of that play. Oh, and a very good back pass. This will give Violent Panda a shot opportunity, but Squishy breaks that play up. Squishy off to the side. Turbo with the challenge. Torment hits it downfield. If that was on target, that would have found the back of the net. Squishy off the ceiling. Panda with that challenge, but Gimmick forces it through, gets another touch here. Centers it to Torment, Torment popping it up. Now Squishy out into the middle, Torment racing back, tries to keep that in the zone, and Squishy will have to retreat. Not much boost for Cloud9. Van Panda pushing that out, needing support from Turbo, but Turbo doesn't get the contact. Kadop pops it right back up. 
Now a chance for Cloud9. Gimmick getting turned aside by Turbo. Now Panda with a shot. That one just off to the side. A close call, and we saw some very early goals in the previous games of this series. This one starting out neck and neck. But now you're seeing a Dignitas coming up as a group, all three of them together. Here's the third off man for the, the shot. backboard and a miss. Net wide open, but Turbo was able to be the first one back. Kate up, off the corner, hits it up. Gimmick was waiting, the shot. Panda with the save, Squishy following it up, and that one turned aside by Turbo. Dignitas able to get that clear. Panda with great speed. Now Gimmick, no boost. Torment hits it off the corner to himself. Gets it by Panda, but Kadoff's waiting. Hits it back, Panda off the ceiling, dropping it down. No boost from him, he leaves it for Kadop. Gimmick keeps it in the corner, good challenges from him. But he'll need some help, Squishy's there for it. And now that ball out in the middle, Gimmick needed to get in Panda's way, he did just that. But the shot, that one, Chuck testing Squishy. But Squishy was able to make that save. Dignitas pushing for the mistake, but they're just not finding it. So they keep pushing it to the corner, Cloud9 is not having any trouble playing defense here. Dig need to cross it to the midfield. Now we're under two minutes left to play in game five. Still scoreless. Chance now, Panda. Gets getting the challenge. That deflection and Kadops drops it just wide. Tignitas threatening now. They've been in Cloud9's half for so long. Now Squishy with the flick. Turbo first to it, Torment backs off. Does get one touch, goes for the challenge. Turbo off the backboard. Squishy and Gimmick both jumped. Kadop trying to keep it in. Turbo misses touch. Now Gimmick will have it. Gets it over to Torment. Torment, he gets it by Turbo and Net. And Cloud9 take the lead late in game five. Was this because Turbo went up for that first one? No, he had the boost. Oh, he put it behind him. Turbo pulls it, was face to the left. The shot came to the right, and he didn't have the reaction time to pop back in cloud nine. Perfect placement from Torment. Turbo could not turn around in time. And now cloud nine, oh! Squishy, a big save there. Now Gimmick on 1v1, wins that challenge, and that ball gets shot off to the side. Turbo on the attack, Panda up. That shot blocked again by Squishy. Less than a minute left to go. Less than a minute before Cloud9 ends the streak. Gimmick. And now Torment. A miss there, chance for Squishy. Squishy a weak shot. Final 30 seconds. A block. Now Gimmick, pushing it up the sideline. Just melting time off the clock. Squishy into the corner. Another touch, pass out into the middle. Torment is there! Two to nothing, 11 seconds left. Cloud9 in a position to end the streak of Dignitas. That could very well be the secure 10 seconds left. One more attempt. And they won't make and it. And that is it. The streak is over. Cloud9 take the first match in the grand finals. We have the final match. Game number one. Cloud9, Dignitas, who is going to take it? Panda up against Squishy, off to the side. Turbo misses his hit. Chance quickly for Cloud9, but a save from Kadop. Kickoff goals were the themes of, it was the theme of last series. We saw it go both ways, but more in favor of Cloud9. But looks like Dignitas have escaped from it this time. Cloud9 came out so hot in the first match. Dignitas looking to prevent that. Game one victory here would be huge. Torment, upfield Panda, 
Hits it back to Kadov on Gimmick, cuts it off. Double tap, Chance. Gimmick, he, does he it. hits it! All the pressure riding in on this, and they open up the series with a double touch. Clinical from Gimmick, and ugly from Leafex. Thanks for that. <laughs> Gimmick, he has been incredible. The MVP for North America, and he is stepping up in the World Championship. Torment, self-pass. Gets one touch, going for the pinch pass here. Gets it out into the middle. Gimmick with the boost steal. Cloud9 on the attack, Panda with a chance. Goes for the backboard pass, Squishy. Misses his hit, but Torment gets the long clear. Cloud9 have earned the respect from Dignitas. You can see them pulling back when they think that Cloud9 has control. By the means they're not getting the challenges, they're giving Cloud9 the room to breathe. And Gimmick with good defensive plays. Preventing Turbo from getting that attack mounted. But Chance now, Turbo! Turbo answering back, we're tied up. Seemingly coming out of nowhere, a bad touch from Squishy. Gimmick trying to follow, but that challenge from Kate up and Turbo there immediately. That's the speed from Dignitas. The three time looking to make it four. Dignitas, they make sure that game number one does not go the way of Cloud9. Gimmick off the ceiling, gets another touch out into the middle. Kate up and Torment both miss there. Squishy beats out Turbo Ball. Out into the middle. Panda prevents the shot. Chance for Torment. Torment, Torment well-timed shot. Double commit. Kadop with the bicycle hit gets the save. Now Gimmick with some time. Flicking it into the Dignitas half. Gets the boost steal. Center ball, squishy. He gets met at the point of the shot. But now, ball floating back. Dignitas on defense. Squishy up, the shot high, bouncing into the middle, Gimmick! Just missing that opportunity. Torment, in his own corner, trying to slow play, Kate up with the challenge. Turbo, passing it out, Gimmick gets to it first. Panda, going for another touch, low on boost, he'll miss. Kate up, also getting played there by Torment, but Turbo, that shot, narrowly missing making the threat when he watched two of his teammates flail up for it, not make contact, and get pulled out. He knew that next shot had to be a threat or it wouldn't buy his team time. Dignitas are looking for the counterattack. You can see when they're on defense, they want to find the sweet spot. And now they've had this extended attack and a good what second a touch challenge. there from Turbo, a little fortunate. Turbo sends it across net, Kadop with the boost steal. Dignitas attack starting to mount. Torment. The center ball finds Squishy, Squishy gets blocked by Kadop. Now Panda heads it up to Turbo, who's going to try to get this out of the zone. Does flick it by one, gets a dunk. Ball bouncing out into the middle. Torment with a good touch there, trying to get that ball out of danger. Turbo gets it over to Panda. That shot's going to be wide. And now Cloud9 with a chance. Squishy with that challenge. Turbo wins it at half. Trying to pass it off the backboard, a double commit. Panda gonna try to get an angle on that one. Torment gets it his way. And now Squishy up off the backboard. Out into the middle, Panda gets the clear. Only one player on Dig has enough boost to challenge and he just hit it, Violent Panda, knowing his team needed that clear. And it all comes down to this carpet. This game one could set the tone for the final match of season six. A demo there, Squishy, with the shot, follow up from Torment, he hits it! The team plays! Kimmich, he got the demolition, he didn't care how he did it, but Kadop and Violent Panda stuck on the ground. And Torment in the final minute, gets Cloud9 the lead, but Turbo on the kickoff, Almost forcing that through. Can they tie it up right here? Chance Kate up off the backboard. Turbo's up. He gets the, the demo. demo. But Gimmick in reverse gets this ball out of danger. The challenge, Torment hitting it into the corner. Kate up going for the boomer. That gets stopped by Squishy. Center ball. Kate up back into the corner, but Torment hits it to the side. 
k -Dop, good first touch, goes for the shot here, and that one hit by Torment high of the net. Fantastic defense from Torment. Dignitas will not give this up. With just 17 seconds, they're trying to stay on offense. And that pass into the middle, broken up. Time winding down. The shot, the the pass. shot blocked by Torment yet again. k -Dop with some space, goes to hit it off the backboard. Squishy gets the hit. Final chance, Panda to Turbo Turbo. The pass in front of net, but it won't be enough. Cloud Nine take game one. Cloud Nine and Dignitas. We're starting to see them both finally bring out the peak. Nine shots from Dignitas and only five from Cloud Nine. Dignitas did not go down quietly. They fought till the bitter end. The last pass from Turbo Pulsa. Had he just had a couple more seconds. And Torment, big plays on both defense and offense. We'll take a look at this go ahead goal by Torment in the final minute. And look at that. Torment, he's been having a fantastic tournament. And you can see the emotion on Gimmick's face. They are into it. Cloud9 is feeling it. Now they are one step closer to achieving the unthinkable. Taking out Dignitas. They're matching them in pace. They're getting the physical plays, the demolitions. They're selfless. That last go-ahead goal, the opt for the backboard pass instead of the shot when you know you have the angle just to bait out that defender, just to give yourself a better chance. Cloud nine. I've never seen them play this calm with this much pressure. Game one goes to them in this final best of seven. Here we are, game number two. Let's hear it for Cloud9 and Dignitas. Gimmick, going for another touch here. Gets the flip reset potentially, no, it bounces by. But Turbo bails out Dignitas. Another kickoff narrowly escaped by Dignitas. It looks like Gimmick just wasn't able to get that flip reset. A touch there from Torment, that's going to send it high. So we've seen missed. such great defensive touches from Torment that bail Cloud9 out of danger. Now Torment with no boost up to Gimmick. Gimmick, that shot won't be on target, but it forces Panda to be in an awkward spot. Kadop handing it over to Turbo, who side flips. Chance for Squishy. Torment with a demo. And now, Violent Panda, big win there. That'll buy a lot of time for Dignitas. Now Panda up, the shot towards net, easily saved by Squishy, a gimmick with a bop. And now Torment, the follow-up passes off to the side, but Squishy had to swerve out of the way of that Panda attack. Nice read by Squishy, but it might have been a little bit too overzealous. Didn't have anyone to pass it to, but they didn't find any punishment on it. And that shot oh, from oh, Turbo oh. finds its mark. It looked like it might have been wide, but Turbo sneaks it in. I saw the two defenders there, and it didn't look like he was challenging it that aggressively. And Squishy actually had the angle for the save. Genuinely caught off guard by that goal, but Turbo Pulsa. Turbo starting the charge. Dignitas now leading in game number two. This is the final match. Torment. On the wall, no boost. Just trying to get in the way, gets a bump there. Center ball, Panda, Kadop both commit. Panda off the side, Kadop up in the air, centers to Turbo, Turbo the shot! Gets it underneath the Cloud9 defense and Dignitas ahead by two. And there it is from Dignitas, Violent Panda out to Kadop, looking for Turbo, that's the midfield passing that they have perfected throughout league play, and they're bringing it out here in the final series. That's the Dignitas we're used to. How much did it take out of Cloud9 to get that first matchup? Do they have enough left in the tank to take it to this Dignitas team, or will Dignitas claim that third title? Torment, upfield, Turbo. Over to Squishy, Squishy up in the air. The demo, but Torment will recover and hit it down. But Kadop is there to prevent the clear. Squishy up to Gimmick, Gimmick. Trying to find Squishy, that ball bouncing through. Chance for Torment. Torment 
Going for the double tap. It ran out of boost, but Dignitas is scrambling right now. Squish it with some time. Passes to himself. He's going to air dribble this through. See what he does with it. Goes for a pitch. Torment, Torment that shot. That'll be wide. But Kadop hits it to the side regardless. Squishy. Heading it towards net. Gimmick with a redirect. That one was going to go wide. Torment with a 50. Panda with another hit. Gimmick waiting for it off the ceiling. Now Turbo running out of boost, but does manage to hit that across the field. Gimmick with a challenge. Dignitas now in their corner. Final two minutes. Squishy off the backboard. Kate up. Refuses to let that one bounce back to Turbo. Turbo downfield. C9 corner. Turbo. Not able to get that backward, but Panda's there. Drops that down. Squishy has to come off the wall. Torment both commit for it. Now chance for Panda. Panda going for the double, but Torment was ready and waiting. Gimmick on the quick counterattack shot. But that one's saved by Turbo. Double commits on defense from both teams. But that's because they feel the pressure. They don't want to risk a tiny misstep. They don't want to risk a weak save. Two of them are going for it just to make sure. I'm sure it's not on purpose, but the pressure is on for these teams. And you know they're feeling it. Their entire season boiling down to these final few games. Turbo flicks it by one. That might be a shot on target. That one narrowly missing. Squishy able to get that goal line save. Kate up towards net. Torment with the save. Kimmick to himself. He'll try to take this challenge. Panda hitting it downfield. Squishy will hit it strong off the corners. Bouncing out into the middle. Torment with a chance, but he wasn't able to connect. Does get a touch there, but Turbo will hit it downfield. Gimmick got a piece. Dignitas playing smart, only sending two players up, especially with this physical play we've seen out of Cloud9. They seem to have their sights and their crosshairs on Turbo Pulse, so he's been demolished more than anybody in this series. But time's running out for Cloud9 in game two. Dignitas about to answer back. That shot blocked by Kadop. Turbo with a miss, a demo on Squishy. Gimmick's there. Gimmick a chance, but Turbo with a big block. That is going to melt so much time off the clock. And after losing the first match and the first game, Dignitas bounced back with a victory in game number two. But the respect has been earned. They are giving Cloud9 the room. They understand the threat of their opponents. Dignitas, the fact that they're able to bounce back at all after a series like that, they have such mental fortitude to be able to keep fighting. They've been in the upper bracket this whole time. They nearly got taken out. They win the game five against EG, a team no one expected to even take a single game off them. But Dignitas, they prevail. They keep playing. And Turbo again, topping the charts for scoring for Dignitas, getting both the goals. And Cloud9, they only had three shots. Gimmick took all of them. Squishy and Torment were not even able to register a shot. So Dignitas, absolutely dominant in game two. And so far, Turbo is the only player that scored for Dignitas in this second series for the Grand Finals. I'm hoping that's just circumstantial, and I hope that he's not the only one that's keeping up with it. K-Dop, Violent Panda, they really need to support his teammate, and they have been so far. I really just think that it's just, he happens to be the third man on these attacks. It's not because he's the best one, but man, is that guy fighting. He's looking for the four time. Turbo, he just has that X factor, but K-Dop was the golden striker. Violent Panda, the clutch playmaker of Europe. Dignitas have an arsenal, and they are bringing, bringing it out in this final match of season six. And we have game three underway. Panda trying to pop it by one. Kadop, Turbo took his boost there. Now a chance for Turbo, but he gets beat to the ball by Squishy. Panda. Up off the ceiling, going for another touch. Torment beats him to it. Squishy down the sideline. Now Gimmick will have to turn for this. Pops it by one. But it loses possession, out of boost. Turbo going for the backboard. Squishy denying it. Torment with that challenge, he misses in Panda. 
Going for a block. Just too slow, but Kadop hits it back up field. Gimmick switching the field. Squishy was waiting. Center ball from Squishy, but Torment wasn't close enough to that pass. Both teams toying at each other midfield. They're not chasing it down. They're not getting too aggressive. They're keeping at least one, maybe even two players back. One double commit there. Chance for Cloud9 if Gimmick can get a strong shot. Going for the double can tap. Can he hit it? Bounces it by the defense. Gimmick with the highlight reel shot. Everyone looking for the hard shot to net. He goes underneath them all. Kadoff even trying to read that. Gotta feel good, Gimmick. He is freestyling in the grand final carpet. To be fair, that man freestyles every time he jumps off the ground. Have you noticed that? Squishy said Dignitas, their way is the way to play. But that shot right there embodies everything about how Cloud9 plays the game. It's a battle of styles. And right now, Cloud9 poised to take it. And a save from Squishy. Squishy following this up. Torment comes in to help him. Squishy with the demo, but KDOT got it to Panda. Panda with the back pass to Turbo. Shot wasn't on target. Torment hits it into the corner, and Turbo now with the demo. We're seeing Dignitas start to get physical. KDOT racing back. Gimmick. KDOT, although he got demoed, he prevented that shot. Now KDOP in the corner, squishy on the wall. Torment. Now Turbo up to Panda. Turbo, not there quick enough. Squishy has a chance, going for the double tap himself. Bounces it in as well. Squishy extends the lead. You know, are these two guys the same team? It's the same goal. It's almost identical. Squishy and Gimmick, the double touch. And beating it with the bounce shot as well. Cloud nine. They are going insane here in game three. Kate up. Putting that shot towards net. Squishy getting it out of the zone. Gimmick goes for the challenge. Got Squishy it. will take over. Pass off the corner, up to Torment. And Torment. Wasn't able to get the shot. Panda with the save. Now Panda on the counterattack, going for a shot. And he'll bail out. Kadop using up all his boost for that. Violent Panda. Going for the center ball. Torment denying it. Kadop centers to Panda. Panda gets the goal. Dignitas within one. The challenge. When I saw Turbo go for this, I was almost upset but it was just enough to force Squishy to thinking he had to get the heart clear. There was someone coming to challenge it, and all three Dignitas players in Cloud9 Taft to keep this to a one goal game. And KDOP, that pass, brilliant. Getting it out to Violent Panda for Violent Panda to finish off. And the shot from KDOP, testing Torment. Torment makes it happen. A hit backwards, chance for Squishy, and he missed the open net. Dignitas getting bailed out. Squishy to Torment, double commit. Torment also missing. Squishy turning on it. He's got another. Going for the double tap, but Panda doesn't let that happen. Defense. Gimmick getting stopped by Torment, or by Kadop rather. Now ball out into the middle. Panda getting dunked on by Squishy, and now Gimmick challenging Turbo. And Torment coming in. Torment Another? with back-to-back -back dunks. Squishy with the center ball. Gimmick gets to it first. Dignitas, no boost for them. They're struggling. They're low. Cloud9 on the assault. And the feels backflip man. Torment able to get the goal. Getting completely suffocated of boost. The most was Kadop with 20. He was the one in that. He, he knew it. He felt that he had no time to get to that. Even with 20 boosts, he didn't even use any. The accidental backflip, Cloud9 punish Dignitas. There's still one minute remaining in the game. Dignitas not ready to give up just yet. Torment takes control. That shot blocked by Panda. Gimmick center ball. Kadop waiting for it. Touches it by Torment. 
Here comes the counterattack. And a good touch from Panda. Torment taking his time. Panda with the challenge. Kadop backwards, tries to get the challenge, does get it up in the air. Turbo not managing to get the shot. Final 30 seconds. Dignitas need one right now. The pass to Panda. Panda back to Kadop. Turbo, he was waiting, but Gimmick gets the save. And now the counterattack. Torment responds. That is the dagger. Three goals up. 17 seconds. I don't care who that opponent is, Dignitas or not. This ain't uh, happening. This is incredible. <laughs> USA, USA, USA. The crowd rallying behind Cloud9 as the final seconds of game three tick away. And that is it. Cloud9 take game number three and move one step closer to the world championship title. Let's go, boys. Over both series, they're now six and two. If you combine them together, they've won six games and only given up two for Dignitas. Cannot believe they've done that. They're showing the mechanical skill. And Carpet, look at these plays from Cloud9. The double touch shots, back to back. Gimmick and Squishy both making mind-blowing plays. I actually really want to know how intentional the bounce shots were. Because the bounce shots are honestly what made it harder to save. Everyone always expects it to be just a bullet straight in the middle. Well, they I both mean, drop straight down. You, you expect that players are going to bounce up or jump up for the ball to challenge. So if you can get it underneath, that is golden. It's almost like penalty kicks in soccer, where you try to predict where the player is going to commit for the save, and you try to outthink them. Squishy and Gimmick, they made absolutely incredible shots. Those double taps on the biggest stage, adding in some flair. And now they lead in the series two to one. Just take a look at those numbers on the bottom left-hand side of the screen. Just take a look at that. Cloud9 up in the series. The final series of the day. Everybody get up. Dignitas. They've been in this situation before. The final match. Their backs to the wall. No more lives left for Dignitas. Cloud9 eager on the attack. Game number four. Kadop. The ball now into the corner. Torment off the ceiling. Squishy doesn't let Panda get the touch. Torment got with it. the shot and a block by Turbo. Turbo not letting that early goal in. And here comes their counterattack. Squishy upfield. Panda now into the middle, the shot coming in. Turbo again with the block. Dignitas need to find their offense. Right now their defense holding strong, but for how long? Torment gets pushed away. And Squishy now with the challenge into the corner. Turbo, a booming clear all the way to the backboard. A chance, a demo on Turbo from Squishy. Again. And now Squishy beats Turbo. Turbo left floating in the air with no boost. He's left back, and Torment takes advantage. Cloud9 get the lead in game four. Back and forth, and the demolitions work as intended. The double commit, pulling them both out of the midfield. And Torment, that man vying for the MVP. Dignitas now, this is where their mentality is truly tested in the first minute of game four. Cloud9 getting this lead. Dignitas need to stop the bleeding, but Gimmick tears the wound wide open. Two to nothing, Cloud9. The curse of the kickoffs. We've seen it against these two teams back and forth. A missed touch on defense. They just can't recover quick enough. And in just one minute, Cloud9 are up by two. Just seconds later, after the first goal, Cloud9 Put another one in. Panda with that dunk, going all the way back. Squishy hits it safely into the corner, but Panda out back into the middle. Gimmick going for another touch. Squishy getting it by Kadop. Cloud9 dominating the midfield. Off the backboard. Squishy going for another touch. Puts it into the corner. Torment with the challenge. Kadop forces it through. Panda will have a touch, but Squishy not giving them any space. Turbo, 
Has to just clear it long. Now Squishy and a double demo there, you see. And the K redirect <laughs> right in front of that K-Dop gets Dignitas back in the game. Taking full advantage of this rotation, putting himself in the middle of the net, going for the goalies, and then making sure he got that touch into the net. Beautifully done by Dignitas. Dignitas is not out of this just yet. Plenty of time left on the clock. Down by one. K-Dop. The Golden Striker getting that goal for Dignitas. Torment. Off the backboard, Kadop with the clear. Gimmick stops the ball at half, but Kadop has some boost. Gets it by Gimmick. Turbo looking for the retreat. Turbo now heading it up into the corner. Panda looking for that pass. It bounces down. Turbo went for the demo, and Gimmick will take control. Dignitas staying a little bit closer to each other on offense. They're doing a great job of using that dribbling skills to pull out those Cloud9 defenders one at a time. And now Dignitas, they're starting to work that midfield game. Cloud9 has been dominant so far. Dignitas appear to be bouncing back. They need another one. Torment racing to it. He'll pick up full boost and he'll just hit that and chase it down actually. Instead of going for the pass. Now center ball, Kate out with some time, but Panda cuts him off, just sends it into the corner and gets that boost steal. Perhaps we'll see a Dignitas attack. Turbo, that shot off the crossbar, but Squishy got a piece of it. Turbo's there, no. Side flips, lets that ball go into the corner, not he, necessarily a bad play. He had no boost as well. No point in challenging that if you can't follow up. And now Gimmick. Great big flick. flick there. That one floating. Torment up for it. And Turbo hits it off to the side. Now Turbo, no boost. Tried to find Kate up, but Squishy again, just suffocating. Now Torment off the backboard. And a one two clear. Kate up and Panda get it out of the zone. But Gimmick with some time. Good first touch. Going for the dribble. And he hits it. He gets it. I can't believe it. Two Dignitas defenders in front of him. He stays patient, he waits for the flip from Turbo. And flicks it to the bottom left corner. Gimmick stepping up for Cloud9. A one goal lead is never safe. That go ahead goal so important. And now the chance for Turbo. But he put that wide. Now Turbo, did he challenge Gimmick, a wide open net, and he puts it wide. The dunk there from Torment, and now Turbo with the clear. They have that padding, thanks to Gimmick, but still, kickoff goals are very possible. Dignitas not out of this yet. Off the ceiling, chance for Kadop, and Squishy gets in the way. Turbo getting demolished, trying to be the third man. Great now defensive Kadop, play. Kadop dropping it down, but Gimmick with the deny and a demo again. Torment clearing it out of the half. Squishy with that touch off the backboard. Kadop just takes his time. A double commit there. But Turbo's ready, going for Does the double tap. It? Trying to hit it. And Torment gets it to safety. Final seconds time running out for Dignitas. Turbo scrambling back, but his efforts are futile. Game number four goes to Cloud9. Hey, James, help me out of this map real quick. How many more games does Cloud9 have to win? It just takes one, Carpet. It just takes one for Cloud9. One more win. And take another look at this gimmick goal. He had Turbo hook, line, and sinker. And you have to look at Turbo's decision. He had a player behind him that had that right angle covered. You would have thought he would have swung it wide to make sure the gimmick couldn't have done exactly what he did, which is sneak it to the outside corner. And you can see Cloud9 smiling. They are so close. And Carpet. 
James. Season one was the sole victory for North America. Cloud9 about to bring that title back if they can do it. From the lower bracket as well. And if you told me anyone would have to double or beat Dignitas in back-to-back -back best of sevens, I would have told you it was impossible. Now Cloud9, one game away. Las Vegas, are you ready? This could be the final game of season six. Cloud9, one game away. Gimmick now into the corner. Torment. Now Panda, squishy. Going for the pass, that shot actually. He got it! He does it all himself, squishy with the early goal. Watching him go for the second touch in the first 14 seconds. They put themselves in the lead, what is that angle? I thought he was gonna pass it, but he surprised everybody going for that shot. Squishy making it happen. Dignitas need to answer back right now. They can't let this game get out of hand. Get up there. And Kate up. Get up there. do just that. Dignitas tie it up. Violet Panda and the touch gimmick nearly there. He thought the shot would come, but Kate up was there to support, putting it under the final defender. And we're back at a tied game. Kate up, brilliant positioning and precision on that pass or on that shot. Getting it past the defenders. You can call it a great pass. <laughs> Passing it right to the back of the net. But now Torment. Turbo. In the corner, Torment. Keeping it in the zone. Squishy with that challenge. Torment racing back. He'll leave that for Gimmick. Gimmick with a good first touch, but Kadop with that block. Torment with the clear. Squishy has that demo, so numbers advantage briefly for Cloud9. Turbo to Panda. Panda misses his shot. He had no boost. Now Squishy pushing it downfield. His solo effort opening up the score sheet for Cloud9 in game five. And a pass up, but Kadop cuts it out. Torment chasing this into the corner. Squishy off the wall, going for it, but Turbo gets it by Panda. Now on the counter. You Gimmick. should be scared when you start seeing Squishy go for those. He's feeling confident, but Dignitas are here to fight. Now down the sideline, Torment getting that full boost. Hitting it across the field. Violent Panda got that boost steal. But Double Gimmick miss. now has time. Challenge from him. And he'll retreat back. Kadop also having to turn. Dodges the demo, hits it upfield. Kadop cuts it off. Gets that second touch by Panda, and he'll leave it for Torment. Torment, no boost, just puts a shot towards net, forcing the defense to make a play. Now 2v1, Panda, that shot off the Get crossbar, out! and Gimmick gets a piece of it. Such a big touch from Gimmick to break up that attack. And now on the other side of the field, Cloud9. Torment drops it down, across the field. This could be the final game. A double demo from Turbo, almost a triple. Squishy knowing he needed to buy his team some time. Just smack it out and carry it across. Past the halfway point of the game. Dignitas, no more lives. And that shot might find people surprised, but double commit. Panda in the corner, Torment last back. Does hit it to safety. Now into the middle, Squishy hits it downfield. Gimmick just gonna wait. Squishy now has an opportunity. Panda getting challenged, no boost for him. He'll have to leave it for Turbo. Torment's there, doesn't have the boost to go for a double tap. But gimmick, a great first touch, going for the dunk, but Panda gets it by. And a miss there, miscommunication chance for Gimmick, but he has no boost. Ball bouncing to the net, and that one hit off to the side. Cloud9 mounting an assault. Squishy passes to himself. He gets Flip, it. it. Can he do it? Squishy moves. Does it go in? Torment finishes it off. What a play from Squishy and Cloud9. There's never a stage too big for that man not to show up. One of the most talented mechanical.
skilled players there is in this game. And he pulls off a flip reset. And with that, Cloud9 take the lead. Nets wide Whoa. open. And Dignitas get right back into it. The kickoffs again. They're cursing both of these teams. Squishy pushing that back mid, not aware where his last defender is. And Violent Panda keeps it tied. Dignitas are the defending world champions. It's not going to be that easy, Cloud9. They answer right back off the kickoff. And now Gimmick. Squishy, that shot knocked to the side by Turbo. Panda jump, but he couldn't get to it. And Turbo gets the lead for Cloud9. Back and forth, trying to keep control. Losing all of his boost and all of his ability to play defense. Torment, you hear the chance and an MVP caliber finish right there. And giving off the kickoff again, Carpet. Now two goals separate Cloud9. It looks like they might do it. What on earth is going on with these kickoffs? Either they figured out how to do them perfectly, or they've all forgotten how to play against them. A minute left for Dignitas to catch up, to stay alive. Dignitas, their time is running out, and Squishy off the kick off again. Five goals now to two. Cloud Nine, they are destroying Dignitas. They don't even know how to feel. Torment put his hands on his head like he was in anguish. He probably feels like he's in a dream. Three goals up against Dignitas, the two-time world champions. And that kickoff going towards the net. There. And the response from Turbo. That is exactly what Dignitas needed. Only a few seconds off the clock, and Dignitas within two. It's a home run derby for these teams right now. Dignitas at 50 seconds. And they're a team I've got full faith that they can pull it off. An absolute slugfest. Kadoff has to back up, gets the hit. Gimmick now into the corner. Panda, the center ball, Turbo gets challenged there. Now, counterattack. Kadoff with a great first touch, 1v1, but Squishy doesn't give him any time. Kadoff misses that shot. Final 30 seconds. Las Vegas, let's hear it. This could be the final game, just seconds away. Turbo down into the middle. Squishy takes possession off to the side. Turbo. Ten seconds. Six, seven, six, Cloud nine. Five, they three, are about to two, do the unthinkable. They've done it. Cloud nine dethrones the kings of Rocket League. The title comes back. America Carpet, what a series! Since season one, North America has not held the title. You see disbelief on both sides. Cloud9 in disbelief that they just took Dignitas. And you can see Turbo, a class act there, Cloud9. It seemed impossible, Carpet. They lost in the very first round and had to win series after series. And they do it. Cloud9, your season six world champions! We talk all the time about teams playing passive and Squishy lands a flip reset in the last <laughs> series of the Grand Finals. It couldn't be more picture perfect. But there is no doubt that Dignitas is world class. They made it to the Grand Final through the upper bracket carpet. It seemed like it was in the bag, but Cloud9, they made it happen. Squishy Muffins, Torment, Gimmick with the tournament of their lives. And what an incredible feeling it must be. Multiple top four finishes 
but they could never get that title. They finally break through and do it here in Las Vegas. North America takes it home again. And Tapper awarding the medals, Torment. Let's hear it for your world champions, guys. Cloud Nine! The full lower bracket run. Pretty much the most games any team could have possibly played. They kept their brains in it. They kept it strong. And Squishy, let me tell you, my friend, you might want to rethink your words on whose style reigns supreme. Cloud9 with their flash and brilliance, make it happen. But that's enough of us up here, Carpet. Let's go hear from your world champions. Leafex, take it away. Cloud9! second right now we got to hear from these boys your world champions of season six we'll keep it brief because i know you guys need to run around and let this energy out how's it feel man it's unbelievable honestly i don't i i did not expect this at all starting today um we, we started from losers round one and i honestly i'm just so proud of the team and you know proud of us for making this far the longest run ever i think in any bracket in the rlcs how you feeling Feels great. <laughs> Squishy, I talked to you before and you said, you don't need to do what we do. I'm thinking you were wrong, man. You need to do exactly what you need to do. Is this the new style? Are people gonna have to play like you, Nan? How are you feeling? I think we're just playing perfect today. Um, I'm so proud of my teammates and how they performed. I don't think, uh, it's necessarily a play style you should copy, but <laughs> we played great, and I'm so proud of them. Probably the only ones that can do it, Cloud9. And that leaves us one more thing. But now, it's time for MVP. And you guys have been calling for it all night. It's none other. The Torment! The longest run in a tournament we've ever seen, Cloud9 tears through every single other team, pretty much. Tainted Minds, NRG, Flipside Tactics, the Chiefs, we them girls, and then they take out the defending, defending world champions twice. North America, it's been five seasons, but it has come home. The world championship title is back. Cloud9 just won seven series. An entire league play worth facing elimination. It started at DreamHack Atlanta. The Muffin Men, Gale Force. It all started there. Exact same scenario in the grand finals. The Muffin Men come on top. It is the start of their history. They repeat that same occurrence here, but this time they end dominant after two best of sevens against the back to back world champions. You have got to be kidding me, Rocket League. <sighs> Let's get into that Mobile One high performance replay. Every single player stepped up for Cloud9. Torment was MVP, but Squishy with insanity, pulling out those iconic shots time and time again, exactly when they're needed. Gimmick stepping up in a huge way. Cloud9 achieving the impossible to become your world champions. They didn't even expect it, but they just got in the zone, and they are on the stage all day long. I hope they still like playing Rocket League because... <laughs> oh, they do. They, uh, yeah. I, I, still, I, just, I still can't believe it. And there has been nobody more critical 
then C9, then me. Probably <laughs> all season long. I remember that hill, Allegiance. Yes. That was That's fair. That's the fair. greatest <laughs> hill, I think. And to be yeah. honest, I could not be more glad to see a team make me eat my own words all season long. Torment stepped up huge, squish him up with 12 assists Gimmick. over the entire series. Gimmick, Gimmick. popping off, Gimmick. scoring yep. crazy shots. They outscored Dignitas 27 to 13. Well done. Let's take a look at our championship bracket. We are done. All the matches are complete. We started in day one. All 30 games were played. The perfect start to a world championship event. Weedem girls and Dignitas emerging to the upper finals. More on that later as we saw the lower bracket run that will make every history book in textbooks across the world in a few years. You'll see. Cloud9 <laughs> taking out Tainted Minds, Energy, Flipside Tactics, Chiefs, and then they kept on going. Weedem girls, a 4-2 victory. In that first best of seven, they crushed them. A 4-1 victory, and then 4-1 in the second one as well. Cloud9 showed up. Sometimes you just have a good day in Rocket League. I don't, but Cloud9 did today. And Dude, no other they didn't team. have a good day. It was the entire tournament. Yeah, you get bounced down to the losers in round one, Game and then it's just like, overtime. it's all the way back. You didn't, you do, you're not allowed to have just one good day. It's got to be the whole way. No team beat Dignitas more than twice this entire season. Cloud9 just had to do it eight times to become world champs. These Rocket League gods, they do bleed, they do break, but only because Cloud9, all three players, they stepped up big. I've never seen Torment play that way. I'm looking at the stats from these two series. I wrote them down, and after about game four, I just... It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter. They beat them eight to two over two series. You've got to be kidding. That's unheard of. It doesn't make any sense, and I love it. That's what Rocket League's all about. It comes down to the day, and that's all that matters. How did Cloud9 play today? Absolutely perfect. Squishy said it himself. They did exactly what they needed to do. We have a ton of people tuning in online. I want to make you all aware of the schedule we have upcoming. We're not done with Rocket League this year. Coming up next week, we have the promotion tournament, finding out who's going to stay in RLCS, who's going down to the rival series. That's next weekend. And then on November 30th, we have E-League Rocket League. Definitely tune into that. A lot of these teams are going to be there. So the Rocket League keeps on coming. And finally, we have the CRL National Championships. All about those colleges. Arizona, Penn State, Akron, and North Texas. That's on December 8th. So a lot of Rocket League still coming our way. And the promotion tournament next week. That's, yes. Yeah. There's we have still to more. figure out who has a chance for the title next season still. It's incredible. <sighs> incredible Rocket League not only today, but we still have so much more to come. How are you feeling, guys? Amazing. Absolutely amazing. That I'm was speechless, man. the biggest favorites ever Let's for any world championship in Cloud9. Season four, they come in hot. They won two lands before it. They were the favorites then, and they lost, and they felt that heartbreak. Then day number one, they lose on day number one. Game five overtime, how do you bounce back from that? They have to take out energy in game five overtime to make day number three. And they do all of that. And they take the title by beating the best team to ever play Rocket League. You can't have it more perfect than that. Stay to shock, man. Stay we're to shock. We're, we're done, guys. We're done with season six. Final thoughts? It was awesome. Glad to be a part of the RLCS this season. Let's do it again. Dick and Toss. Dignitas wants that revenge. We'll see him at E-League, so that'll be a lot of fun. I want to say a big thank you to everybody who's here, all the families. My, fa my parents are here for the first time. There's a bunch of OGs from the community. Dapper's handing out the trophies. Like, this, uh, this one's special. It's been a long time since NA's taken it. It's coming home, you guys. It's coming home. We keep making history with RLCS. Thank you, everyone, for tuning in from around the world. Everyone here in Las Vegas for making this a spectacular event. Plenty more Rocket League to come on the calendar. There's so much work done behind the scenes to make this happen. The production crew has been incredible. All the commentators, everyone involved with this production to make this one of the best shows we have ever seen. And, of course, huge congratulations to Cloud9, making history in style, becoming your world champion for Season 6 of the Rocket League Championship Series. Stay Stay tuned. Plenty more coming your way on twitch.tv slash Rocket League as we continue the path of Rocket League into the future. Ignite gets it away. Turbo pulls it off the respawn onto the backboard. Running low on boost, but finds the angle himself. What a Three time takes the lead. 
you can't stop the man. Doesn't matter how many defenders you got in front of him. All it takes eight seconds and it completely swings in Dignitas's favor. That's Transition one. blocked. A great defensive effort by Squishy to keep Cloud9 in the lead. Time hit zero. The Chiefs looking to score. They don't. The Cloud9 move on. Top three. You heard them on the desk talking about it. What a play. Are you kidding? The final five. Remco can't do it. That clear will do it. Cloud9 secure their chance to challenge Dignitas in the finals. It'll be North America versus Europe for the World Championship. This is their job. This is what they do. This is what they've been practicing for. The grind is all for this. They've been here before. Can they do it again? Squishy with the challenge. Torment again. Gimmick with a shooting opportunity. Good first touch. That shot just high. Follow up from Squishy. And Cloud9 take game one. One more attempt. And they won't make and it. And that is it. The streak is over. Cloud9 take the first match in the grand finals. Double commit there, chance for Cloud9 if Gimmick can get a strong shot. Going for the double can tap, another? can he hit it? Bounces it by the defense. Gimmick with the highlight reel shot. You hear the chance and an MVP caliber finish right there. And Gimmick off the kick. 